Hey YouTube, doing a review on the Twister Mini Sport, as you can see. This is a one-bladed helicopter um, with a back rotor, pretty much really good. It's USB charge, so you can plug it into your computer or uh, your iPod charger. Sometimes they can come out and you can plug that in or just any USB device. So let's get this little thing open. Okay, so in here we've got the helicopter. I don't know if you can see that. Yep, so you got your helicopter. Let me just over to the side. Which, um, one blade, really good bearings in it. You got your little battery. 3.7 volt battery. Which just plugs in, which slides into. Your helicopter just there, and yeah, okay. Um, so yeah, so you got your helicopter and your battery. Just let me put that there. Um, comes with a spare set of blades. This is the ones that I've used, it's bro I've broken them already. Um, the wings aren't actually snapped, the wings are actually really, really durable like you can bend them and everything that the thing that's gone in them is there's posts that go into that black bit there and they've gone so see how they've it's when you crash because it has a sudden impact on the wing and this has hit the ground and just goes doosh and it snaps the wing bits that go into there so it gets wobbles while it's going um so you got your spare wings, comes with a charger, that's a USB charger, plugged straight into your battery. If When you get it, there's a little red uh, arrow thing on there, and an uh, arrow on there, and you got to have both the arrows pointing to each other. Make sure that you do that, because otherwise, it, it can break your battery, and these are a LiPo battery, so you got to be watching them when you're charging because they can live battery batteries uh, like they can catch on fire sometimes but this is a very safe charger because when the battery is charged it actually turn it cuts off the power to go into the battery so you don't have to worry like you still want to watch it there's a light in there it'll turn on when it's charging it'll turn off when it's done but you still want to watch it like it doesn't matter even if it does turn off you still have to watch that so you got that it comes with a spare back blade rotor blade just there that one hasn't broken um, on the box see how it has um it has a little blade that has a little wing thing there on mine it's come off and I've lost it which you don't actually need very like yeah it doesn't do much to it maybe when you're flying it makes it not twist as fast but yeah just yeah you don't really need it, it comes with a spare one of them too but I lost that one as well put that there um, the controller, you got a four channel controller, 2.4 gigahertz. Um, so you got your, I'll show you, your throttle up, down. That's, so your throttle makes, so throttle up and down. The, uh, this going side to side makes it go like that one. Okay, um, on this, up is forward, down is back, side is spin, so if you go to the side it spins like that. And um, yeah, you got all trims on this, with a, and you also got a little digital display there. 
which is really good. Let's turn it on. You've got your little digital display. Don't know if you can see that. Um, yeah, really nice controller, easy to use, really good helicopter to get up to before you go up to a bigger helicopter. Um, I would recommend one like this before you start going up to a big helicopter. I've coloured in the blades on this, but um, yeah, the blades just come oops, standard white. Um, I just got some pen and coloured them in. Um, yeah, like I was saying, really good, flies really nicely, nice and smooth, all the controls move smooth, none of them get stuck, no matter where you go, um, so everything's really good on the turning, um, no real big problems, just the blades, like I said, the little shaft things going, um, the wing's really durable. Let me turn that off. Stand that up here. The wings on this are really, really durable. As you can see. You can bend them all the way up. And they're still all fine and everything, so... Yeah. The wings on that are really good. That's that. The wings on this are good because when you crash, they don't just snap like some of your cheaper helicopters or the much dearer helicopters. So it's really good to learn on, especially because it's a single blade. The double bladed ones, I've got a few of them as well. Um, they make it more stable. So this is the perfect one before you go up to a bigger one. Um, landing gear, it's got landing gear, it's got a thing, got a gyro on it, let's take this off, so you got all your electronics, there's not much to it, um, I've had no problems with the electronics, uh, you got your little motor there, little antenna for the 2.4, you got your shell which has little air vents in there, um, the gear's been going fine on it, nothing wrong with it so far. The uh, only problem that I have had is that I crashed and this is sitting on a, I don't know if you can see a little plastic thing there, and that's moved back when I've crashed from it hitting up against something, and the wires got a little squished and the none of this was really working, so if, that ha if you do get one of these and this happens to you, that's the that's the problem with it. Um, really good helicopter. Motor's good. Everything's good. Uh, see if this battery has a bit of power in it. Quickly. So you just slide the battery in. This also has a little red. I don't know if you can see that little red arrow. And so I've got the red arrow on that pointing. Okay. So there's that.
And there you go. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and press like. Thank you.